Hey guys, oh man, we are live. Tycoon Thursday, Tycoon Thursdays. All right, let's. Um, all right, guys. So today we have some amazing things to actually share. We're going to talk about the power of options. Sean actually has some absolutely amazing case studies to share as well. Some amazing companies. Are you all excited, my friend? Okay, Sean. So let's get started, shall we? As more people stream in along the way, let's actually right. get started and actually share some really, really important information. Right. So this week, dude, it's been crazy, right? Like on the streets in America, everybody's talking about one topic and one topic only, and that's the name of George Floyd, right? Like um, the riots happening, people are throwing bricks, all that stuff. But hey, the market has actually gone up like crazy, right? So, bro, you know what do you think about all that, man? You know, people. People are saying that the curfews are going to be back on because all these riots are going on. People don't care about coronavirus anymore. If you see the videos, man, if you see the videos, you know, barely any of them are wearing masks. They're going out to riot. And, mm -hmm. you know, if I don't know if you actually know this, but yesterday was the largest spike again in coronavirus. Right. US, right 19,000 people in one day it's crazy man because people don't care anymore they're just going out to fight and protest and hey man what have views about that and, um, and and all that stuff happening this week well uh i mean okay i i i don't want to say regarding the news specifically yep. uh, but if, if you have been in the market you will not be surprised with uh surprising news and how the market is going because the market has always got some reason for them to go up or down there's always a reason there's a no no point in time like there will be like a two or three days or even a one whole week with with no news. So hey, by the way, I, I I saw I saw the video. It was it was really very sad. I can't breathe. And then, well, I I I feel like it's it's really something very sad. And and very few people actually did something about that. But I, I guess it's a topic for another day. As as investors, right now the question is, can you breathe in this uh, market? Right. I mean, I'm not trying to make fun of the whole entire concept, but the whole entire thing is this now. You some sometimes right. You also feel like you're being choked. You have no choice. But the truth is, we are a lot more lucky. Especially if you are right now listening to us, right? You you are in a very I would say good condition in a sense. No one is forcing you to do anything. But what should you do now? In my opinion, the market is something that is is always crazy. One Warren Buffett said that his teacher taught him that the market is a guy called Mister Psychotic. There's no reasoning to trying to. Uh, there's there's no way trying to guess what the market is doing. Okay, so. Now, uh, basically, in my opinion, it's still all about position sizing. And, and later, I'll share with you a very simple trick. Like, you can, you can be safe, you can be safe, you can lower your risk and still have higher returns. So that, that's the whole thing. There's no way we can control the market. There's no way we can guess the market. But we can still make money regardless of whether we know the market or not. How many of you love that? In, meaning to say you don't have to predict the market, but you still can make money really comfortably if you love that please please type me okay I, I think it's important yeah this is called investing wow dude uh, like how how is that man tell me tell me why what's the secret behind that actually you know the secret uh. you see now uh, <laughs> later maybe i just show you a bit of my account right for those mm. who know for those who know right the the market has gone up by i i I'm, i didn't calculate i, I think it's almost oh. about 20 to 30 percent if you yeah. realize Absolutely. it's about 20 to 30 percent Yep. And and all this while, right, for me, all the data is telling me that the market will go down. Okay, rather, it's telling me that the economy will go down. And and we do know that the economy goes down. Uh, except for like tech companies or certain companies that, that write on the e-commerce trend, the market is going down, right? Uh, for, for most of the company, losing money, okay? Or making not as much money. But however, however, the stock market is going up. But because I know data-wise, data, data -wise, I, I assume or, or I, I deduce that the market should go down, I'm not co committing all my cash. This is very simple. I think that there's 70% chance that the market will go down. Therefore, I keep 70% cash. Now, why do I still put 30% in? If I think that there's a high chance that the market will go down, why do I still put money in? Because I know that I don't, I'm not always correct. How many of you know that you're not always correct? If you know that you're not always correct, please type yes, okay? So, one punch man secret training uh. yeah yeah the, the one doesn't really help in uh, investing uh. It, actually it does right yes, like, man, bro, it does yes it, it keeps does. you clear it keeps you very clear discipline right so yeah. so the thing is this uh, now i actually use 30 percent of my cash and i still buy good companies and the cool thing is this although these stocks right they went up by about like 20 percent because of the market uh rising but because we use options right instead of 20 percent, we are making something like 100 percent Mm. We're making, I, I think it, it is, how many of you, how many of you use options before? If you use options before, please type options and you know how powerful it is. You, you know, correct. So you see, 
I put 30%, it went up 20%, but it went up the whole entire ROI, stocks went up 20%, but the ROI of the options that I committed went up 100%. So in fact, my whole entire portfolio, just by committing 30% of my portfolio, right, I have already increased by about 30 to 40%. My entire portfolio, again, listen to me correctly, I only put 30% of my cash in. So example, if I only have uh, $100,000, I only put in $30,000. But this $30,000 has almost gone up by 100%, meaning to say I already make uh, $300,000. So think about it this way. This whole entire portfolio of mine right, already went up even more than the stock market. Stock market only went up 20, but I already went up 30%. But I still have 70%. In case the stock market goes down, I can go in again, another piece to go in, and I still make money. This is the power of making money in the stock market without having a lot of risk, without we having a buffer. And if anything goes against what you're thinking of, you still can go in and make even more, more money. This is the power of it. Oh, yep. beautiful, man, dude. This is the power of options. It's incredible. Sorry. So, dude, can you can we get into some specifics, man? Right? So, we, we talked just now, we talked about some companies you're actually looking at. Like currently right now, what, what is one killer one? What's one amazing uh, company you're actually looking at, if you don't mind sharing? Okay, uh, let me share with you one company that I'm looking at. Okay, but, uh, how many of you guys are, which country are you guys from? So that I know which context is the best. It, like, like if you're interested in, okay, I, I guess I'll, I'll focus more on US. Now. In fact, today I found a Singapore company that, well, when I saw it, my saliva actually dripped. It's one of the few Singapore companies. Hey, by the way, all of you can invest in Singapore companies as well, just as Singapore companies will have options. So maybe I skip that part, but later we got time, the company I feel that, wow, you just invest, huh? I cannot imagine you losing money in that uh, 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 if you just hold on to it. Okay, but later, if you are if in enough interest, I'll talk about that. Now, what, what company that I'm looking at right now, right? Let me let me ask you guys this. Uh, how many of you are sports player? Sports player. If you learn if you learn sports, right? Can you please type sports? This company sports, has to do with sports. You learn sports, right? I love now, sports. But a lot of people cannot play sports now, right? So what is a very good, I would say, substitute? Okay, it is not really a substitute. But have you heard of esports, guys? Esports. Do you do you know which company which company do you come come, come to mind when you actually think of esports? Any, any any companies? This is one particular company that I personally have been looking at. I'll be diving very deep into details uh, in some of my uh, analysis. But but just a very quick one. This company is called EA Electronic Arts. Okay, let, let me just go to the. Okay, and I, let me tell you why. Okay, Electronic Arts. This is what company that I am looking at. Do you want to add your screen, bro? Yeah, you can see my screen, correct? Yeah, you can go to my screen. There you go. Wow, this company, I feel that there's a lot more potential to grow. Okay, uh, how many of you play computer games? And but this this company is not just about computer games. It is into esports. Of course, their platforms are a little bit more limited, uh, but they are expanding a lot. They have future growth. But one thing that really makes me like. Again, uh, my saliva drips, right? It is, it is this thing called a valuation. The five years average valuation is 26, P ratio of 26. Now is less than half. Now, it is very seldom you can find a company like this, okay, that is growing very fast with huge potential. And right now, during all this COVID, uh, during circuit breaker, during like um, movement control measures, right? All these, all these orders that's keeping people at home, right? Guess what a lot of people are doing? We are spending a lot more time and on electronics. I'm not saying it's healthy, lah, by the way, but I'm saying that this company, even before COVID, has a lot of revenue, is has been making a lot of money. And right now, wow, look at the look at the valuation. This this is something right that you can see is historical low. Usually it's 20 something. Now it's only 11 something. You can buy this company at half price. Would you like to buy a good company at half price? And the cool thing is this company can continue to grow, you know. I I, I don't know about you guys. Do, do you guys believe that gaming is something that's going to be big? If you believe that gaming, I mean, when I talk about gaming, I'm talking about electronic games. I'm not talking mm -hmm. about gambling. You know, resort, they also call it gambling. But but personally, I don't invest in gambling stocks uh, for the reason is, uh, I, I think Rash will agree to that. Uh. We are going to be accountable to, to, to God one day and, and he said, hey, you are the boss of a casino and uh, I, I'm not going to be feel comfortable about that. But gaming-wise, I think it's, it's to, to me, I think it's, 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 it's healthier. I'm not, obviously, anything that's too much is not good. But this one is something that is growing and has been growing very, very fast. So this one company that uh, I, I personally like a lot. Now, how, do, do you play games? You don't, right? You only do gym, you only invest. This guy got no life. Lah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, man. It, 
Dude, uh, like gaming, there's the the one thing about gaming which I want to share is this, bro. Yeah. Do you know that in the last um, in the last one month, I think nearly three billion games were actually downloaded on the Play Store. You know, what? three billion. Dude, the, the numbers are the numbers are crazy, man. Like you know, because people at home they're downloading games on the Play Store and everything. So it's it's nuts, right? Even actually, you know, right now, uh, even more so than gaming, one of the things to really look at is really. Uh, mobile games as well, man. Like mobile yes, correct, games. Correct. You know, I did this case study recently. I did this case study recently. You know, one way to very easily find for companies, uh, bro, is to go uh -huh. to your Play Store and actually yeah. find out uh, the top downloaded games. That's right. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. Actually, many, actually yeah. Uh, yeah. You're right. You're right. You're right. And many of these companies are, uh, bro, are listed companies, you know, dude. They're listed yeah. companies in Korea and stuff like that. Very, very interesting. So this is how you can find for investing ideas. So many games being downloaded. You know, go uh, on to your Play and find out which companies are the listed companies. My wow, exactly. It's exactly. So now, now I play a lot of games, right? Then my wife said, hey, How come you always play game? I, I tell her, No, I, I'm doing stock research, I'm making money, you know. <laughs> no, I'm just playing games, okay? Yes. So, hey, by mm -hmm. the way, we are, we are diving deep into games. Hey, uh, Felicia is here, so Felicia and, and myself, we're actually looking at some of the gaming companies. This, this is just one of them. Do, 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 you, do you want actually? I have a few, right? I have a few. Maybe, maybe before I go to one that I feel that's super solid, I, I share one more, Ken. I, I got a lot that I want to share. Okay, be, 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 share the big one. Yeah, guys. You, yeah. If you all, you all want Sean to share one more. If you want Sean to share one more, can you please put in the love button? Smash the love button if you want Sean to smash share one button. more. Come on, right? Smash the love button. Let me see the love. Right. So again, you know, um, I think uh, Xiao Hing Sim is saying about EA very low growth. I think right now, you know, you got to look at the recent quarter numbers, right? Yep, Many yep, of yep. The companies right now, the growth numbers are next level already. All right, you got to really have a look at the most recent quarter. Um, you know, the past numbers do not dictate what's happening right now. So in the last quarter, the numbers have literally just gone through the roof, right? So that's something to actually take note of. All right. So again, we're going to actually do that. <clears throat> and guys, if you want us to actually share, if you want Sean to actually share this and you know that this will benefit a lot more people, I want to invite you to share this video right now. Share this video so that more people can actually benefit. And again, very, very simply, if you all want Sean to share the big stock, right the big idea that he actually has what i want you to do is very simply share the video if you get at least a hundred shares right if you get at least a hundred shares then sean will actually share okay so we're looking at the number of shares if you get at least a hundred then we'll share more okay so sean i think we're going to share the small one first we'll go to the big one Let's we'll share the small one first. okay okay be be before i share uh because i saw quite a number of people from singapore as well right hey by the way uh friends who are outside singapore in fact in fact you can look at your your own country this one is something that's in singapore but in every country right there's this particular stock that all of you can invest in. Uh, I believe there's a there's a strong future for, for it. Okay, so so I just share with you guys in Singapore, right? There's this particular stock that's called SGX, Singapore Stock Exchange. The price has dropped a lot tremendously. Uh, valuation wise, is decent, uh, but this is one of the few stocks, right? In Singapore, uh, unfortunately speaking, uh, I will say that these are the few stocks that I, I actually believe there's a huge growth potential, and and um, okay. I, I, I say this very openly, guys. Do, do you mind if I be super open? If you if you don't mind me being super open, please type open because I, I, I do not want to I do not want to actually filter anything, but I, I also want to be sensitive. Huh? Okay, one one reason why Singapore stock exchange is going to benefit a lot, right? Uh, unfortunately, it's also because of Hong Kong. Huh? Because Hong Kong now is in, in, in quite a lot of distress. But uh, okay, I, I'm not I'm not going into politics, but as, as an investor, you must know this. In in this region, right, typically it's Hong Kong versus uh, Singapore, in terms of financial, like where you want to put your investment hub, where you want to put your derivatives, where you want to lease, right? It's actually these two, uh, okay? So so now if Hong Kong is somewhere that is being, being a bit shaky, right? SGX is going to benefit a lot. SGX has been having a not such a good year. Actually, actually, you, you look at the finances, it's beautiful. It's super beautiful. The, it has been growing a lot. It's just that the reputation is not as strong as Hong Kong. But right now, I can tell you it's a bit different. Just, I, I, read, I read Business Times this morning, right? There's a lot of company listing in Singapore right now from, from overseas. They are shifting out and then they are putting their headquarters in Singapore. So we also do know that a lot of people are more interested in stocks. The volume is going to increase. A lot of things is going to increase. The fees is going to actually... You're, you're going to benefit a lot more in, in Singapore stock exchange. So, so this, this is a small, a small idea. Well, got a lot of ideas to share now. Okay, so, so, so this is something that you can think of. Yeah, Hong Kong money flow to Singapore. You guys know that, right? So... When we look at all these things, right? Don't don't just look at the news. Look at opportunities, guys. 
like uh, Raj always mentioned, wow, open up your eyes, open up your eyes, exactly. right? You gotta open your eyes to see, man. Open your eyes to see, absolutely, one hundred percent. So next question I have is this, guys. Right? Hey, guys, come on now. We need to share. We don't have enough shares for Sean to share the big company, right? So again, yeah. please share the video so that uh, so that Sean will be able to share his next big uh, idea, right? So again, I'm looking at it. If you've shared the video, type in shared so I can actually see, right? So share this video, and uh, I'm waiting. <clears throat> A lot of people are saying SGX Z Z Z Z Z boring, right? Boring, right? So boring yeah. is good, though. Okay, so this one same thing, lah. Buy for your children's education and forget about it. But you can imagine SGX closing down. You cannot oh, correct. No. And yeah. the price now, you go and look at the price now. Okay, you go and compare to the past like one two years. Very nice, fantastic, fantastic. There right, bro. Boring. Yeah, right. I, think, I think I think a lot of them today they want to know about you know some interesting companies by as well as let's let's also talk about options and some of the beautiful things that's happening in the options market right now. Oh yeah, yes yes that's correct. So 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 are we ready to share some more stock ideas? We have a lot let's to share. Go. Let's go. Uh, okay, come. Uh, let me share the screen. Can you help me share the screen, bro? Yeah. Are we there? Yep, we're there. Okay. So if you look at this company, right, the revenue has been increasing, okay, from 40 billion to 70 billion recently. And the income, right, you, you can see it fluctuated a bit, but is it doubled, it doubled, okay? So this company is very strong in terms of the growth rate. If you look at it, it's not, it's not, it's not weak also. Uh. So you can see uh it is it is above 15%. You can see the growth rate is above 15% for the past 10 years, fast growing company, and I believe there's still potential future growth are there competitions are there like people fighting this company the thing is there's not a lot of competitors there isn't a lot there are few here and there there's not a lot so this company right again it is it may sound boring but it's not you know this, this company is actually very interesting and this company is called intel now a lot of people like to look at very exciting things that you don't understand but do you understand intel guys any of you guys are you are, you are customer of intel if you are please type intel and, and i want to share with you uh, this company again has a lot of future potential growth because a lot of people will be doing like home based, uh, work from home, home based learning. And what do you need? You need a computer. And Intel is not, is not going to actually like slow down on the growth. In fact, they will ride on this, right? And I want to show you again. Uh, again, right? One thing that's very important to me is valuation. So for Intel, same thing, I'm hunting cheap stocks. Huh? The valuation is 12, P, P ratio of 12. Again, it's historical low, okay? And it is, if you use the matrix of PEG, right? Comparing the growth rate to P, sorry if I'm going a bit advanced. Uh, so I'm, I'm assuming that some of you guys have uh, uh, studied this before. If not, you can rewatch this video, understand more, learn more. Because when you learn all this, right? This whole entire stock market is it, like, a, it's like, a, like, a, like a place for you to just pick up money, you know? And how do you pick up money? Find a stock that's making a lot of money, buy it at a good valuation. Then after that, you're picking up money. How to, how to triple or multiply the money by five, use options. And that's how you do it. So, so this stock, right? How many of you, how many of you use Intel? Can I, can I take a look? Okay. So, so this is Intel. Okay. You can say that Intel is losing market share. Okay. But you go and take a look. The whole entire industry of Intel, right? The whole entire addressable market is growing a lot. So, so they are fighting with AMD. Now. But you go, go and check your latest uh, laptop. Very likely, there's still Intel inside. Very likely. Now. Right. You know, bro, you know, a lot of people, they like to say that, oh, it's losing market share, for example. And maybe, yeah, maybe, yeah. right? Other companies are competitors. Always be competitors. But I believe, I believe what I believe is everybody as a whole is rising up. Yeah, yeah, correct, correct, right. So, so you know in, in fact, right, the reason why the P ratio is so low, the reason why the valuation is so low is because they were perceived to be losing market share. But you think about it this way, yeah. Losing market share doesn't mean you're losing money. Did, did you see, yeah. guys? So, you, you, if you look at the statistics, they, they have already been losing market share already. Okay, so so example, uh, the, the whole entire market share initially is 100 million. And then they were, they were actually 60% of it. Then now from 60%, they drop to 50%. So they lose market share, correct? But the whole entire market share from 100 million becomes 200 million. So it's, it's still growing a lot more, you know? So if you look at it in that perspective, right? And, and it's not losing market share very, very drastically. It's just, mm. just a bit, it's still competing with AMD. We can dive in a lot more. See, here's the thing, guys. You know, in any industry which is actually making money, then more companies will actually enter, right? When more uh -huh. companies enter, obviously your market share gets less. But uh, you know, if it's if it's something that is 
is great, then hey, then the entire, everybody eats more, basically, right? And that's how these companies are actually growing as well. Same thing applies for Intel, same thing applies for AMD, right? But in right. terms of valuation, AMD is a lot more, a lot more not attractive as compared to Intel, right? Even though I love AMD as well. And by the way, yeah. Sean, I'm a, I'm an Intel customer. I'm also an Intel investor, by the way. Just to let you know, oh, I was like, hey, my cool. Yes, yes. Great my thing. Like, and you use, use options or use stocks? I actually have both, bro. I actually have both. You know, I've I've calls on it and I also have shares on it, right? So I've been holding Intel for some time already because I I saw they was undervalued even from last year. So, dude, I I love Intel, man. Right, right. So, so, so the thing is this, lah. The thing is actually sometimes investing don't need to be exciting. I mean, you uh, you ask yourself, guys, lah. Do you want to have fun, F U N, or you want to have fun, F U N D? Can you please type F U N or F U N D? So sometimes having fun or building a wealth, right, needs not be fun or exciting sometimes boring is good i like to take boring companies i like to buy them when they are at the correct price and then i turbo charge them using options and make a lot of money if i want to have fun i go and i go and do actually what's fun now i go, I go and play electronic arts games like right more fun mm-hmm. or you can play a uh, brawl star or angry bird i, I don't know lah. okay <laughs> uh okay ken ken chai wants to have both uh. yeah mm-hmm. you have fun in investing f-u-n-d in investing you go and find fun in other places okay go and find fun in other mm-hmm. places very nice very nice and yeah so the beautiful thing is this guys look i think i think the, this person raised a very very good point right if you think amd is getting over then get both lah correct not yeah yeah, yeah. you can't you can't <laughs> there, there's no way one of them will be totally taking over you know because there's an antitrust law they will there'll be monopoly there'll be a lot of issues on that so you just buy both uh but but you buy both in phases lah. now now intel is cheaper you buy a bit more intel then when intel goes up amd goes down you buy amd so after that you get both of them but both of them you buy at a correct price correct EEA can have fun and fun. Yeah, that's right, that's right. Tencent, Brawl Stars. Yes, that's right. Eight Tencent, Brawl Stars. Uh, no, Brawl Stars, okay. Actually, Brawl Stars belongs to Supercell. So I, I bought SoftBank because of that. <laughs> interesting, okay. interesting. So bro, come, let's let's share about options and everything, right? The power of that's options. Right. We talked about repairing options. You know, we have so many things to share, man. So uh, let's get down and down uh, into that. Okay, sure, right. sure. Uh, if you I, can share my screen, right? Let me just share with you something about options. Also. Now, I, I, I've been sharing some of these uh, ideas. Uh, can can you see my screen, right? Yep, I can see your screen. Okay, so is it zoom in? Is it zoom? Yeah, in? zoom in. Yeah. Okay, zoom in. Uh. so you can mm-hmm. see. Uh, this is example. Uh, I actually did this. I did this trade Berkshire Hathaway. Uh, this one is uh, one of my accounts. So you can see Berkshire Hathaway, right? That time I was showing uh some of my mentees uh, that I actually bought these shares at hundred and seventy eight dollars. Can you see that? Hundred seventy eight dollars. And at the same time, right, I also bought a long term call. Okay, what what does it mean? Options. I I just want to show you how powerful it is. Uh. So I actually enter these two trade at the same time. Same time, uh, guys. So now, uh, it is to demonstrate how powerful option is. You can see that the market price of the stock is 190. So 178, go up to 190. Do you, do you think it's not bad? If you, think, if you think it's not bad, please type not bad, okay? Uh, I think it's not bad. Well, you make some money, you make 6%. Can you see? 6%. Now, options, right? You can see options down here. It is, again, I did not do anything different. I did not like wait for another few days to enter. At the same time, exactly the same time, I bought options. I buy stocks, I buy options. Exactly what are options? Options is a, a financial tool that allows you to use much lesser cash. And therefore, when the price goes up from 178 to 190, right? Instead of making 6%, I make 37%, which is six times more. Would you like to make six times more of returns by choosing the correct stock? And guess what? My risk is actually, uh, let me calculate. Uh, this one, $30, is It's almost five. Okay, my risk is five times lesser. My returns is six times more. Lower risk, higher returns. Now, if you are totally new to options, uh, I, I would suggest you get an education on this because, because a lot of people ask me, how, how do you invest with, with, letter, with, with little income and stuff like that? Actually, options is a very good way to get started because you can actually use a lot lesser, lesser capital. And, and even if you have a lot of capital, right? In fact, I will still suggest you use options right now because why? I do not want, in fact, some of my mentees, they come with six figure portfolio or even seven figure portfolio. Again, when you have a bigger portfolio, you there's more things you can do, but you take a certain portion, put into options as they grow by a small percentage, your whole portfolio grow, grow by a lot. Okay, because you're using options and you can have a lot of money to, to put aside, right? In case of anything, you still can uh, do a lot of cost correct. So, so this this one thing. So this is how powerful option is. That's, that's why I, 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 I hope that more people are more educated in options so that you can really grow your money faster. And the cool thing is, is grow your money faster in a safe way. 
It is not a speculation method. It is not a gambling method. It is a very highly intelligent method. Good stocks, use options, you make even more money. Very, very simple. So this is one power of options. Options got a lot of other powers. Did, did we mention other things that we wanted to say? Yeah, dude, dude, it's very, very powerful, man. As in both of us have been using it for quite some time as well. And it's been absolutely amazing, bro. It's that's been right, great. That's right. Right. Yeah. But dude, again, again, you know, somebody actually, Raymond is actually asking, can we compare risk this way? Share price cannot, should not go to zero. Yeah. A chance that buy call cannot go to zero, right? So how would you answer that question? Oh, okay, Raymond. I, I, I love this question. Because if you think about risk, right, you are thinking of the right thing. This is the powerful thing. Now, the truth is share price will go to zero. Who says share price or not? Have you seen share price going to zero? Does it say yes or what? So Berkshire Hathaway, right? Just now, if you look at the trade that I make, uh, I was actually buying Berkshire Hathaway at $170. Can it go to zero? Answer is yes, you know. Will it go to zero? Less likely. That's why, that's why we, we reduce the risk by choosing good stocks and stuff like that. Now, so you see, uh, if your stocks go to zero, you lose the whole entire amount, which is maybe $187, which is 18 over $1,000. Okay, but if you use options, right, you are only risking a certain percentage, maybe only two thousand dollars. Will it go to zero? There's also a chance. There's there's no way that there's riskless one. The whole key thing is to reduce risk. Can you all please type reduce risk? Yes, only use for good company. Huh? Now, if it's a good company like Berkshire Hathaway, right? If the stock price don't go to zero, the option price also won't likely go to zero. Of, of obviously, there are more things you need to know about options, like how to how to actually optimize the time. Because options, there's a certain expiry date. So I, 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 I hope I'm not going too, too in depth. Uh, but do master the idea of options, right? You can reduce the risk. For people who let their options go to zero, right? It's because you don't know what you're doing. You go and buy a very short-term options. You don't know how to calculate time decay. Then you go to zero. Lah, okay? For, for me, my options have never gone to zero before. Huh? Because I go for good stocks and I actually optimize time. Very, very important. And also, other, there are other factors to look at. Lah. But, but uh, uh, again... This is the whole key concept. Reduce risk, increase returns. Absolutely, man. Very, very, very powerful. Guys, can I ask, can I ask in the audience, how many of you are new to options? If you are new to options, type in new, right? Type in new if you're new to options. I want to see, I want to see. All right. So very, very important. If you want to learn options, but you're very, very new to it, type in new. All right. And guys, one more time, if you are loving what Sean is sharing, right? If you love how open he is and everything, can you please smash the love button? Let me see the love button come through for Sean, you know, for him being so open in sharing every single thing, right? Again, if you love it, smash the love button. Let him see. Let us know if you love this information, right? Again, there's quite a number of people who are quite new. Oh, no, right? not CFD. Please, please, please not CFD. The, the uh, Doris. So, so can you can you can you share with us can you share with us like CFDs yeah, contract with differences? What's the key difference between CFDs and options, and why do you not really like CFDs? Okay, now personally, I really dislike CFD. Okay, uh, guys, uh, my my information may be slightly updated, uh, but I was burned very badly by CFD. That's why I, I I know quite a bit about CFD. Back then, my CFD right, okay, CFD is contract for differences. When you actually use CFD, if you heard of this term CFD before, right? Uh, when you open a CFD account. You can buy shares also. For, so, for example, you buy Berkshire Hathaway uh, with CFD. You are not really buying the shares. You are just betting against the firm. So, if the shares go up, there's a difference, correct? There will be a certain, they will, they will pay you the difference. If it goes down, you have to pay them the difference. So, it's called contract for difference. Now, mm. the thing about CFD is there is a leverage. Meaning to say, example, if I put $1,000 in, you can leverage up to maybe, you can buy $4,000 worth of stocks. Uh, I'm not too sure whether it's times four now, but back in my time, it's times seven. So when I put in $10,000, I can buy $70,000 worth of shares. But what does it mean? Uh? When I buy $70,000 worth of shares, right? When the share price drop a bit, right? So let's say the share price drop from uh, uh, $7 to, 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 let's say how much? Uh, to, to $5, right? So, so there's, a, there's a $2 drop, right? So from $70,000, it drops to $50,000. That, there's a, there's a $20,000 drop, drop, right? My initial cash is only $10,000, it will be wiped out and I own the I owe the company to ten thousand dollars. And it happened to me before. It happened to me before. Just a small drop in the stocks, I will actually lose a lot of money. A, a, a small increase in the stock, I will make a lot of money. So it's a double edged sword. It's a double edged sword. You can cut yourself both ways. Huh? You can cut the meat, you can cut yourself. Now, op, okay, but one more thing about CFD. Maybe, maybe something something you guys don't know about CFD. Huh? Yeah, you can lose seven times the amount. Huh? Now, CFD requires lesser capital. No, no, there's the options is even much better. Later, I talk about options. Hold, hold for a moment there. I want to share with you something that a lot of people don't know about CFD. Example, if you actually put $10,000 in or $1,000 in for CFD, 
you can multiply by seven times or four times or however much they give you, right? Do you know that if you put $1,000 in and you use $500, you say, okay, I don't, I don't want to actually leverage. I don't want to borrow money. I use $500. Once you use any money in the CFD account, even if you use $500, right, interest starts to actually charge you already. You get charged interest and you charge about 7% per year, you know? So a lot of people never read the five prints. They just put the, put the stocks there. They, they say, okay, it's okay. It's safe. I'm just using my money. You are not using your money. You're not using your money. Once you put the money in. <laughs> okay, it's time. Okay, goodbye, guys. Uh, we have to go now. So, okay. So, so CFD versus options. Okay. Once you use the money inside the CFD account, they charge you interest. It is very, very, it's very risky. CFD's risk is not limited. That's right. They will actually come and ask you for money. Okay. So, you actually owe people money. Yeah? Now, options is very different. Options, the maximum amount of money, listen carefully. The maximum amount of money you can lose if you use it correctly is the amount that you put in. So for example, if I put $2,000 in options, I can actually get leverage. I, get, I, get, I can multiply my ROI by six times, seven times. You all saw just now, right? But my risk is the only amount that I put in. If it, if it drops, it doesn't affect me too much. I just lose that small little premium or the small little portion that I put in. Uh, again, again, it is, it is very wonderful when you do it correctly. Uh, if you do it wrongly, Actually, options, if you do it wrongly, but you're not overly greedy, right? Okay, th this is the cool thing. Huh? Options, as long as you're not overly greedy, even if you do it wrongly, you will not lose a lot. But CFD, you do it wrongly, you are dead. You are really dead. They will come to your house and ask you to pay back money. I mean, they didn't come to my house, lah, but I, I really have to pay back money. You know? I have to top out the account. It's so scary. Okay, so, so do it a safe way. That's fantastic, man. Guys, again, very, very interesting. Guys, how many of you feel Sean is dropping gold, all right? Again, in the last half an hour, Sean is actually, together, we've shared so much. We've talked about, we've talked about, just to recap again, we've talked about EA, we've talked about Intel, we've talked about SGX, we've talked about the power of options. Sean showed you live trades, what the trades he's actually placing. He taught you all about CFDs as options. Guys, are you all loving this session? Are you loving this session? If you are, smash the love button and let Sean know. Type in gold, drop in gold. Let us know, guys. Oh, man, it's absolutely amazing. Right, again, um, there's no about questions. 700 of you all actually here. We can't obviously answer every single question, but, you know, we'll try our best. And again, you know, for those of you all who are new, right? So again, uh, Raymond is say saying something very important. It just caught my attention. He's saying it's, today is a bearish market. Bro, all right. <laughs> It's not a bearish market. La. Today, if, if the stock price drops a little bit, doesn't mean it's bearish. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it, sometimes it makes me makes me laugh, bro. It's, it, right. it, oh, because of, of the jobless report, right? Yeah. It's you okay, one, uh, You will get used to it, one. You'll get used to it, okay? Exactly. You will go up, you'll go down. Every two, three, two, three days, you'll go up. Then another two, three days, you'll go down. It's, it's quite standard, one. Uh. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. Sean, you want to share something on your screen or no? Oh no no it's okay it's okay so 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 okay i saw a lot of people talking about some people talk about singapore airlines in the money out of the money time decay it, all this all this is really very important uh, it, but singapore airlines ah uh, they want they want uh, have to spend another session to talk about maybe, maybe next next Thursday we talk about airlines we talk about uh um talk about some other opportunities uh. in fact i'm looking at this other other company uh you want, you want me to talk about it now or, or next week okay maybe i, I share, share the company but next week we can talk about it it's called tiffany and co it's a very interesting company let's yeah talk about that let's talk about that oh dude i know about tiffany man i've been trading tiffany for so many years dude so i i know quite a bit about tiffany as well i didn't hey. buy my from there though oh you, you didn't buy from there i didn't buy, buy from, from i bought from a private private jeweler which is more expensive right okay because your your fiance is listening huh? so anyway yeah. anyway <laughs> so so tiffany and co right very interesting um if you if you look at the financials, okay, uh my, my screen, right? Maybe you can bro, share. Bro, yeah, so fast, bro. Send me share next week, lah, dude. Oh, next week, next week, next week. Okay, wait, got, got it, got it. Hey, Tiffany yeah. and Co. Super interesting, you know. Super interesting. It may be a very big opportunity because there's some mergers, there's some like, uh, people are going to offer to buy the stock. Some some deal went went off. Very interesting, uh. So yeah, so yeah, take bro, a look. Yeah, yeah. I think they want it now, lah. How many of you all want it now? Type in now if you want it now. Come on. Okay. Let me see. If you want it now, type in now. Or you want it next week? Type in next week, right? You want it now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Type it now if you want it now. I want to see your comments come through. And I want to see some loves as well. Come on now. Right? Okay, so they said now, now, now. Okay, la. then now. Lo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, actually, some of them some of them uh reading it already. La, right? So the, the, whole entire, the whole entire stock price dropped because... Uh, actually, I'm looking at a lot of stocks. Uh, Pi2 and, and things like that. So 
sorry, uh, this this our this our life. So, but, but very interesting now. Okay, so you realize that uh, LVMH said that it's not considering buying Tiffany shares via the market. Okay, so you can see these are uh, they are not considering buying the shares via the market. But you see, the thing is this: when when a company, okay, so it, it looks a little bit more complicated. It looks a bit bit more complicated. But you go and read in, in details. There is this very very possible opportunity for arbitrage. Uh, I think they are offering to buy the shares at I think I think it's about hundred and fifty or hundred and ninety or something like that. So 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 you can see uh, hey, hey, where's the share price? How come it's not moving? Okay, so is it is it stuck? Uh, you can hear can, can you see can you see? It dropped by this amount, right? I think they were offering to buy somewhere around here hundred and twenty something. You're going to read. So okay, what's the worst case? The worst case worst case if the deal doesn't doesn't go through based on current valuation uh, because based on current price, actually. Okay, now best case scenario, the deal goes through. You all will make very very quick money. It will shoot out a lot. Depends lah. I think the next few days, few weeks, there will be another announcement. Then I believe the price may swing, may swing. Okay, but this one right, you must be prepared in case it doesn't go through. You hold Tiffany shares, and Tiffany shares right, the the P ratio is not say super high, but it's not say super low. It's a fair value. It's a fair value. So it's 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 a it's a good. I I would say it's a fair bet. It's a fair bet. Worst case scenario, I hold the shares and I think it's okay. Why? Why? Because if you're going to take a look at the uh, Tiffany's uh, uh, revenue increase and stuff like that, well, uh, you look at the gross margin, you know how much you're paying for their things really. Uh, huh? So you know that their things are actually, uh, you're paying quite a lot for their, their, their stuff. And, and, but, but right now, there may be a certain drop. Why? Because Tiffany and Co, a lot of their products, they, it, it, it is bought by tourists and the, the numbers may go down. So this may be a certain short term risk. But overall, if you look at it, if you want to actually watch a bit more closely at the possible like buying of buying over from LVMH, right? LV, right? You can mm. go and study this. Every time you study, you find something that people don't read into details, right? Is considering not to buy shares via the market doesn't mean they are not going to buy. There may still be a lot of opportunity. So, so I'm going to leave it there. Next week, I will dive in a bit more details, and uh, it, I think it's going to be very interesting. Okay, oh, cool. Okay. This is, this is amazing, man. Hey, and you know, you know, one thing which I love, uh, bro, one thing which I love is this, dude. You know, um, I want to ask, actually, I actually want to call you out, bro. Tiffany, uh, your circle of competence, man. Tiffany, <laughs> uh, not really my circle of competence, yeah, la, but, it, no, but it's, huh? it's something not difficult to understand. It's something that's not difficult to understand. That, that's yeah. true. No, because I, I remember, bro. Remember, do you remember L Brands, bro? Do you remember L Brands and how we got it? They want already know the circle of competence. They want already. Yeah, yeah. No, so, bro, yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, I was oh, just yeah, right. thinking, man. I was just thinking, like, I remember, as in the last time me and Sean did a presentation, and you know, we're pretty bullish on this company called Elbrace, but you know, we got it wrong again. Sometimes we get stuff wrong as well, right? So we were yeah, just yeah, yeah. remember many years ago, man. And then our conclusion was, ah, yeah, shit, lah, right? Our circle competence, not really a circle competence, right? So I think that's also something very important. But in the end of the day, position sizing, right? We get some right. right, we get some wrong, but most important, position size. Okay. Yes, right, right. Carol said something. It's not your circle competence, but your wife's circle competence. Maybe yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Is it Kailing's circle competence? Hopefully not. Don't tell her about it. <laughs> <laughs> no, like she's, she, now she's into buying houses, man. Yeah. So yeah. So yeah. houses a bit more circle of competence, really. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that's amazing man okay dudes so again uh, how many of y'all so what I want to do right now is this you know what me and Sean do is we actually share about options we teach about options in depth we go very very in depth to teach you all about how to reduce risk get maximum gains all that stuff how many of y'all would love would love to learn from Sean and see him live trade and do all that stuff to actually learn about options in depth if you love that smash some love buttons and type in I want if you want that type in I want and stuff like that Right, and I will share with you all basically how we can actually help you with regards to that. Right, <clears throat> us we need. They all are like us we need. We need also. I am not too sure lah. Right, let's, right. So what I want to share. So Sean, do they see my screen, bro? Yeah, I can see your screen. Right. So very very simply, I just want to share. I want to share this one thing. We actually have this program called the Options Millionaire Intensive. This is a program that me and Sean actually created. We actually designed this entire thing right together, our team. And this is a program meant for people who are beginners or advanced. It's an absolutely amazing program. And you know, I highly highly suggest if you are brand new, if you if you really want to learn about options and you want to come in and you want to learn exactly right now in this opportune time, then I highly suggest you come for Options Millionaire Intensive. It's meant for beginners or advanced. And hey, this is a live online 
online program. So no matter where you are in the world, you're welcome to actually come. And our next batch is happening on the 26th, 27th and 28th of June. And this will be 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Singapore time. All right. So Sean, do you highly, highly recommend Options Million Intensive? I highly recommend you to learn options. And uh, if you are really serious about growing your money, this is a, this is a place we really go through step by step, especially if you're very new. If you're very new, or even if you know a bit of options, but you want to really go in depth because the more you know, the more you can control risk, the more you can increase your returns. So I, I highly recommend for those who really want to increase your returns. Right. Fantastic. So that's the options million intensive. And I want to share with you all, you know, in these three days, you know, what will you learn exactly? Number one, you learn how to create instant cash flow under direct guidance from the masters themselves. You know, I'll be coaching. Sean will be there as well. You learn how to create instant cash flow. Right. Sean, what do I mean by what do we what do we, what do we mean by instant cash flow? This is this is a secret, right? That we be called BOSS. Like, it's, it's a secret that used by Warren Buffett since 1993. Uh, he has been doing it and nobody really knows that, you know. It's basically going inside the market, selling options, using this technique by selling options. Uh, again, it, it may sound very simple and it is simple with the correct checklist, with the correct flow. You can just go in and collect money tonight. So if you guys know this, right? In fact, tonight, if you've got a real life account, we can help you make additional extra income depending on what's your capital. Yep. Absolutely, man. So that's number one. Number two is you're going to learn how to profit the exact same techniques that the buffers themselves use, how he actually uses options. We're going to teach you all of that stuff. Right? Number three is about risk management. Like what, Sean, like what Sean said, options is really about reducing your risk, reducing your risk. A lot of people have the misconception that options is risky. But if oh. you use options correctly, if you learn how to do it properly, it's meant to reduce risk. Do you agree, Sean? That's, that's, that's right. That's right. So it is about your intention. Some people, I mean, you give you any weapon, you can use it wrongly. But this particular thing, right, is used for risk reduction. And because you reduce your risk, you will lead on to the next thing, which is to increase your returns. Absolutely, man. And number four, you learn about how to generate powerful returns using a small sum. Exactly. Sean, can you share, like, when, when we talk about small sum, uh, what exactly yeah. is small sum, bro? You can go as low as like $100, $200. And I'm not kidding you. Uh. And, and when you go for all this small sum, right, it is not is you're, you're, you're actually not giving up anything you know in fact in fact when you put in smaller amount of money your risk really reduce right correct because that's all you actually you're actually so-called risking but but the risk is actually reduced when you choose the right stocks which will teach you how to do that as well and the returns is so much high so hundred dollars i mean for, for for you guys who have hundred dollars two hundred dollars you can actually use options already yep Absolutely. So that's number four. And number five, learn how to profit massively from a market crash as well. So the beautiful thing about options is that you can profit from any given direction, whether the market is going upwards, going sideways, or even downwards as well. And that's why we actually share, that's why we actually teach everything in depth with regards to how to make money in all and any given market situation, any given market direction. I think that's very, very important to be equipped with the proper information so that you know how to benefit in any given market situation. All right. So again, this is what you actually receive and total value is easily over 35,000. And let me just share with you all, right? Let me get straight down to it. We've had so many students, guys, if you have benefited from OMI, if you have attended OMI before and you've really benefited, can you put down your comments right now? Put it down. Let us know whether it's a great program. Let them know. Let them know. Again, we've received so many five-star reviews about this and the investment around the world, Sean. You know, when we've done this before, you know for oh, a yeah. fact it's about $3,000, right? That's right, that's right. And stuff, and stuff, you know, this is something they've done for so many years, right, bro? That's right, that's right. So we have been invited all around the world. And uh, typically, like what Rash mentioned, uh, is about $3,000, all right? It's about $3,000. And very simply, right now, because of whatever is going on, you know, we're transitioning online and we want to give you an incredible discount, an incredible discount. And what I want to give to you all is this, right? I'm going to give you all an incredible webinar special, an incredible Facebook Live special, right? And if you're keen, type in I'm keen, smash the love button and stuff like that. I'm going to give you all an incredible special. And what is that special, right? So it's not going to be 3000 uh, what I want to give you all is very, very, very simply a $2,400 discount, all right? And this is going to be available for a grand total sum of only five nine seven US dollars. Sean, do you think wow. that's a ridiculous price bro i mean frankly uh if you are someone who are i mean you're someone who is like ready to make money from a stock market i guess a lot of a lot of them mentioned uh, make back the cost fee in two days maybe the cost fee in five minutes actually because once you go through like the program you know how to make money from a stock market <laughs> basically this 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 program is literally really free if you're someone who wants to invest this program is literally free when you actually use what you learn from the program 
And the beautiful thing is they can start immediately and start making money immediately as well from the comfort of their home. So again, just to make things very, very clear for you all guys, dudes, guys, I want to share with you all, this is $49 a month or very simply $1.60 a day, all right? So where do you sign up? If you want to go and sign up, you can put it down on the comment section. Very, very simply, the link to sign up is tinyurl.com forward slash rash OMI, all right? So again, if, you, if somebody can type it down in the comment section, Mark, if you can type it down, tinyurl.com forward slash rash OMI, put it down on the on the image, bro, all right? So tinyurl.com forward slash rash OMI if you want to register. And today, we have some special bonuses available. For those of you all who want to take action fast, I know there's about a thousand fellas watching, but we have three bonuses and i'm going to give this for the first 17 people and the reason why very very simply is this number one the first bonus that i'm going to give you is very simply you know we're going to actually have a live trading session all right we're going to have a live trading session how many of you all want live trades type in live trades if you want live trades okay if you want live trades type in live trades we're going to do live trading together where you're going to jump together with me you're going to jump together with sean and we're going to actually show you exactly how we do it sean is going to open his account he's going to show you everything what trades is actually placing all of that stuff we can actually show you i do and you watch and after that you do and we watch you do all right so we do this in groups right and but right now it's going to be online it's going to be crazy right and this is going to be a friday night super special this is going to be on the 26th of june right it's going to be a special options bonus uh, live trading session Right, we're gonna have limited seats available for this. We cannot have. We're not gonna do this on Facebook Live, obviously. Right, and we're gonna have this for seventeen people. Very, very simply, you have to actually open your account, download a free demo account if you want to, and that day we will start taking action. That day, bro, if they actually find the accounts, will they start seeing results? Yeah, I mean, we have done this so many times already, right? No matter which part of the world, no matter which, which, really, which, 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 uh, a language you speak, as long as you can actually see what we are doing and you're willing to actually like uh, really take take the knowledge and put into action right you'll see the results uh, how many of you saw results already for those who have attended yeah absolutely man absolutely. Many of that, right things to do and very very simply the special surprise is this you will see both sean and myself right so you'll see sean live trading you'll see in, in you hear my inputs as well and dudes you know you have two powerhouses Tai Kun thursdays happening live y'all can see us straight live it's going to be absolutely incredible guys i, I realized i realized something you just trapped me into saying that i will be teaching in this uh current <laughs> event okay cool, cool cool okay i'll be there i'll be there i i didn't really actually plan to do that but since yeah. you dragged me into this let's bro, do it let's I'm do it new in situations uh, bro but you know <laughs> this guy uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, right. yeah. So anyways, we're going to do this. If you want to register for the 17 seats available, it's going to be a Friday night super special on the 26th, right? So go and register. You can register tinyurl.com forward slash rash OMI. Go and do it, guys. It's a complete no-brainer, right? Go and sign up and you're going to have a ball of a time. And this is another guy who actually made some serious returns just in his first few months of trading, right? It's absolutely amazing. Uh, bonus number two, we're going to give you another bonus. And what's the bonus? The bonus, again, is going to be a live session right so not just online but this is what we're going to do for you all live as well right to get our personal guidance once this covid situation is over what we're going to do for you all is a live three-day class where you get to meet us get handheld guidance all that stuff right the date is to be confirmed but let me just share with you all this is going to be strictly for 17 people and the reason why is because our room capacity is fixed we cannot allow any more than that so very very strict on that so if you're going to take action right now go on the link go and register tinyurl.com forward slash rash omi and you'll get the live session all right so we look forward to seeing you and meeting you live once this entire circuit breaker situation is over all right so that's going to be absolutely amazing and if you want to register tinyurl.com forward slash rash omi and one more bonus i'm going to give you is this the final bonus very simply is i'm going to give you all so again i don't want you to wait all the way until june what i'm going to give you very simply is the entire buss training video so you learn exactly how to use options you learn exactly how to get started right away you learn every single thing and hey why not why not get started as soon as tomorrow right so that's exactly what we're going to do for you all i'm going to give you all my entire cash flow list as well the companies that make me money every single month i'm going to share that with you all and i'm going to give 17 to the first 17 to actually sign up and register right and i'm going to share with you all this video right i actually created this video coronavirus the stocks that will make me a minimum of five six mil profits i'm going to share this video with you as well my entire cash flow generating list i'm going to make this available for the first 17 to sign up right so with all the bonuses you get the live trading with Rash and Sean Sia. You get the live three-day class plus the three-day online class as well. Plus you get the personal cash flow list, all of this stuff. 
oh man, it's going to be absolutely amazing. And all of it is going to be available only for a grand total sum of only five ninety seven. If you want to register, go and register at tinyurl.com forward slash rash OMI. It's a complete no brainer, my friends. And I want to share one more thing. At the end of the day, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take, right? You can either take the shot or nothing happens. Sean, what do you want to share about this quote, bro? Do you agree with this? That's exactly true. Lah, because a lot of people, they have big dreams and they have like big ideas of where they want to go or what they want to achieve. But this, uh, this will never happen un until you actually take the first step. Right? If, you're, if you're not doing anything, you'll not, not, not get where to where you want. Okay, so, so I just share something because some people ask whether this is for beginners. We really do start step from step. I think some of you guys do, do know this, right? We start step from step. And for those who already sign up, uh, you all will get a video soon. And uh, for those uh, who already like really learn and you, please, please continue to practice because you know that you just keep doing what you, are, you have learned in OMI, right? You just keep getting the results and you keep getting money, which a lot of you guys have mentioned. Uh. So already make 1.4K. Yeah, yeah. So, so, so congrats, Haran. Yeah, dude. So again, very, very simply, again, this is meant for beginners. If you're a complete beginner, this is perfect for you to get started. Even if you're advanced, you'll learn some amazing stuff as well, right? So I think it's amazing. Again, if you want to register, tinyurl.com forward slash rash OMI. Don't think twice about it because this is something that will really help you to succeed. And uh, hey, you know, one thing I want to share is this, bro. This is a one-time investment for a lifetime skill, right? That's right. A lifetime right. skill will make you money for the rest of your life. So why not, right? That's right. So so uh, if you can share my screen again, right? Because I think some of you guys, every time Rash dropped me, uh, I mean, uh, dragged me onto the title Thursday, right? I realized he will come out with some very, very special deal. So for OMI, this is a very, very good deal with very, very good bonuses. The, the last session, right? Okay. For those, some of you guys, uh, the last session, I think you all bought this particular program called, this, this is a pre-recorded video, pre-recorded video. And you're asking me how to get the latest stock list, all right? So for those who have finished, congratulations. Go to the program, go to this program that you already bought last week. And then the latest stock list is here. And this program, right? Uh, Resh make a one-time offer last week, but it's no longer available. This recorded program is actually 597 as well. Uh, right now, OMI is three full days with us. And we will, uh, basically it is, I mean, for those who attended OMI, you realize how, how much feedback you get. We talk about uh, real life stocks. We show you how to do options a lot more in depth. So this is really, really a very, very good uh, investment. So that's what, what I want to say. Uh, looking forward to see we, seeing you guys there. Uh, I wasn't really planning to be there, but, but since Rash uh, put me in, next time I must check what he's going to say first, man. Okay, but let's do it, man. Let's do it. Ah, uh, that's amazing, man. I mean, that's amazing. So again, guys, uh, go and sign up for uh, go and sign up for OMI. It's going to be absolutely amazing, and I look forward to helping you, guys. Did you enjoy today's session? Did you enjoy today's Tycoon Thursday? If you loved it, let us know. Love it, and you know, if you if you see enough, love it. Then what we will do is very very simply, we will actually come back next week to actually give you all even more. All right. So again, uh, type in love it if you love it. All right, I mean, love it if you love it. Again, guys, you know, if you are already an investor, that's even better, right? The reason why is because you learn one, two things from Sean and myself, you make all the money back, so, right? So again, great said, go for the cost. You'll not regret it. You'll go make back all your money. That's great. Already increased portfolio size of 20% and donated percentage on it after two weeks. I love all these comments, man. Have a look at this, right? So Angie is saying she loves it, right? All of all that amazing stuff. Yes, the pay, <laughs> right? So I really increased my portfolio size. Look at this, Darwin actually saying already increased portfolio size of 20% donated percentage of it after two weeks. Oh man, there's so many guys who've actually benefited from this. It's crazy, man. Right. So again, thank you guys for sharing all your uh, lovely stories. I really, really appreciate it. You all love it. So what we're gonna do is this Sean, next week. Let's go again, bro. Tycoon Thursdays, bro. Yes, let's talk about arbitrage. Hey, we didn't talk about stock repair today, correct? Okay, okay, next week, next week. Let's talk about stock repair next week and also maybe stock arbitrage. We, we can use Tiffany and Co. as a case study. I think it's very interesting. Oh, right, man. Right, right. I, love it. I love it. Dude, let's do it. Let's do it. Right. One punch man plus six pack investor. Oh, this is going to be crazy. Let's okay, go. Okay, guys, <laughs> please sign up for tinyradio.com forward slash record of mine. I look forward to seeing you all there and take care. <laughs> take all right, care, guys. See you. And God bless. Ciao.